this other scandal that's going on, which we started to talk about yesterday, but it's continuing. The whistleblower scandal is getting juicier and juicier. The latest reports claim that the complaint made to intelligence officials involved Trump trying to get the Ukraine government some, some to speculate, it, some speculate it was to get dirt on Joe Biden and his son Hunter. He's the one that is, uh, was in some kind of a thing. I don't know what it business was. Dealing. Some scandal with a business thing. All right. To help his 2020 election. This is what we think Trump is up to. Trump's consigliere, the fabulous Rudy Giuliani, <laughs> <laughs> was on CNN last night. And Chris Cuomo asked him if he did any digging around. Watch. Did you to ask the Ukraine to investigate Joe Biden? No, actually, I didn't. I asked the Ukraine to investigate the allegations that there was interference in the election of 2016 by the Ukrainians for the benefit of Hillary Clinton, for which there already is a you court finding. You never asked finding. anything about Hunter Biden. You never asked anything about Joe Biden. The only thing I asked about Joe Biden is to get to the bottom of how it was that Lutsenko, who was appointed, right. dismissed the case against Antak. So you did ask Ukraine to look into Joe Biden? Of course I did. You just said you didn't. <laughs> No, I didn't ask him to look into Joe Biden. I asked him to look into the allegations that are related to my client. Rudy, Rudy, compose yourself so you can get your lies straight, okay? So, <laughs> is everything cleared up now from that? Uh, uh, no. All right. What do you think, Em? What do I think? Look, I think it's very reminiscent to what we already know happened in 2016 when somebody reached out and said, I've got dirt on Hillary Clinton. Yes. I also think it tells you that they're afraid of Joe Biden. Yes. And how are we going to get him off? And how are we going to knock him out using whatever, it, you know, whatever it takes? But also, you know what? Do you think maybe Donald Trump could try to run a campaign and win a campaign without relying on help from a foreign government? No, yeah. he knows he can't. Yeah. He knows he can't. And That's I, proven it, already. And as far as Rudy, yeah. look, I know it's not ethical, right, for non-medical professionals to say that uh -oh. he is nuts. Uh-oh. <laughs> But he looked nuts, yeah. and he acts nuts. Well, you know, maybe he's thrown in there to throw off the whole thing. You know, every time he pops up, up they start talking about Rudy instead of Trump. Yeah, but he actually traveled to the Ukraine. He Rudy, I think he was had, on the phone with the Ukraine. Or he was on the no, phone that was, with the Ukraine. No, that, that was Trump who was on the phone with the and Rudy actually went to the Ukraine? That's I what thought I heard. That, uh, maybe, maybe I'm wrong, I but it's, wrong. it's not like he wasn't involved. He was the, involved. Yes, he did. He traveled oh, he to the go. Ukraine. Okay. So it's not just a distraction. This is so, sort of an actuality, right? Mm -hmm. um, I, I, I've got to tell you, I'm not surprised that, if, if true, that Trump would have promised aid to the Ukraine in return for dirt on a political opponent. Right. If true. Um, but it is... Illegal, I would think. Unethical, I would think. But it is something that we saw before, as you alluded to, with the Mueller report. If you look at page 93 of the Mueller report and 110 of the Mueller report, I hope everybody read it. That was one of my recommendations for ladies who get lit. Um, if you look at those pages, it does talk about that Trump Tower meeting. It does talk about George Papadopoulos, you know, uh, hearing about dirt on Hillary Clinton. And the Trump campaign wanted that dirt. Trump Jr. wanted that dirt. They wanted it really badly. And the reason that I have often said that impeachment is important here is because that's a congressional power. It's a constitutional duty of Congress to oversee this president and tell him that doing this kind of thing is improper. But if this is proven to be true, that he did, in fact, try to get the Ukraine to get dirt on, uh, on Biden. Yes. Do you think that uh, Pelosi will say impeach him? She should, because this is now a pattern, right? Mm -hmm. Because now you've got information from Russia. They wanted the dirt on Hillary Clinton we're... and this. Do you well, see how far true. we're moving, if though, true. from what we know right now, which is still not very much? This is what I, I struggle with. But we know so, the Mueller report. This is what, and my personality does not fit with today's cable news environment and how it's so quick to rush to judgment. We don't have all the facts. And so I, str I even struggle being on TV because I would say, take a breath. Let's take a few days to figure out what is happening here because there have already been reports that whistleblower didn't even have direct knowledge of the communication that was reported on. And so I say, you know what, if this is true, if which, it's true. by the way, if it's true, the president will be impeached. This is direct collusion so? with the foreign no. government. There's no, there's no other way that it would if not be true. You think, Republicans, really? the thing, you think Republicans would, uh, he could do anything guys, at all right now for, not, for him to be impeached. I hate even talking about this because we don't know if he was working with Ukraine to trade information. Yes, that would 
cause him to be impeached. I have no doubt in my mind. The other side of that is this is a totally blown up story when we have no facts. There's no gray area. It's a black well, or we white. Know a and this is what we things. do every well, single day. And that would give Trump all the more ammunition if this isn't even true yeah. to say, see, this is what the media does. Clarification yeah. uh, from our conversation earlier. Um, I'm being told Rudy Giuliani canceled a trip to the Ukraine in May, so uh, we are still unclear if he visited on another occasion. No, but so I don't want to definitively say. Right. Maybe he should come on the show. Yeah, right. And clear it up. Yeah.